hello guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is delphine konda and i make videos about non-profit organization community development social impact scholarship opportunities and travel as well so if you are joining me for the first time today please don't forget to subscribe to this channel to leave a comment to like to share especially on the kind of um, content on the kind of videos that you enjoy seeing on this channel so in today's video we will be talking about some of the mobile applications that have helped me as a non-profit founder i believe that these mobile applications can help you if you are a small non-profit founder or if you are working with a non-profit organization or if you're just trying to grow a small business these applications are really helpful in helping you with your growth the first one that i have is called trello trello is a cloud-based application that helps individuals and teams to better collaborate and manage their projects um, on the same platform so trello will help you um, in managing your project with your entire team to set different tasks to create they have like bots that you can create and each board you can go further to add more details you know on the kind of projects that you're doing your deadline your task who is doing what when is it supposed to be done at what time all those things that normally you have to send long emails to have conversations on trello you just have everything on the same platform and that is really helpful the second application is google docs I like Google Docs a lot because of the templates. It has different templates for different occasions that can help small non-profit organizations and small businesses to grow. You have ready-made templates like reports. Um, you have templates like invoices. You have um, financial plans, um, expense reports, all of those things that otherwise you would have to invest a lot of time and energy to design them. You just already have them on Google Docs and you can just customize them to um, meet the branding and the needs of your organization. So I really like it. And what is amazing is that I can use Google Docs um online and have my documents saved in cloud just in case my laptop or my hard drive has a problem another amazing thing is that you can also collaborate with other people within your team you know and via gmail and send them the documents and they can go through those documents and also work on them and all of you have all of the people who have access to it will be able to to view the changes that are being made on the documents the third one is invoice home actually invoice home is one of the very first um apps that i downloaded when i started girls excel it was um i don't know what i was searching online but i remember that i needed to make an invoice and i had no idea how to make an invoice uh it was like the first days of starting so i downloaded um, invoice home and it really helped me i don't use it very much these days because i mean we have grown and we have a team that handles those kind of things but it's still very helpful because it gives me an idea of what can be done and on your mobile application you can just instantly issue an invoice it has an opportunity for you to add your organization logo or your business logo um the name of the client that you want to send the invoice to the amount the reason and then you export in pdf and send it's very professional but yet very simple to use the fourth app that i love to use is um google drive i started using google drive thanks to a friend who advised me to use it because I'd lost a couple of documents um, because my hard drive had a complaint. So he advised me to use Google Drive. And I remember that those were during my chivening days and he even helped me to set up uh, the Google Drive on my computer to download it, help me to use it offline and online. And it's become uh, a powerful um platform that i use to store my documents. my storage experience is never truly completed unless i have my documents in google drive i want to just 
know that they are in the clouds that i can sleep better knowing that they are safe in case my computer crashes or it's stolen or something goes wrong with it i can have access to my document because believe me you do not want to be in a position where you cannot access the document you've worked on documents and you don't know how to access them or you lose them it is very frustrating and i so don't want to be in that kind of situation the next one is wave wave is one of the most recent um applications that i came across and i use it on my phone as well as across um, my laptops so what wave does is that it helps you with accounting wave will help you to um especially as a small business or as a small non-profit organization you can just put in what amount of money comes in what your expenses income and expenses it even has an opportunity for you to link your bank accounts to um, your WAVE account so that when you are doing expenses, it's automatically um, being registered on the account. That way it makes your accounting quite easy. But I just like the fact that it gives you the space to be able to um, kind of record what um, you're doing in terms of income and expenses. I'm still learning a lot about the app and in the days ahead, I'll try to see if there are more applications like that that can be used. And if you know any accounting softwares that are free, please don't forget to put them in the comment section so that we can all benefit from them. The seed um, app that I like using is Canva. Canva is my all-time best. It's... Um, good for designing for branding for everything when it comes to branding your organization canva will help you with templates for instagram youtube twitter facebook reports newsletters pictures logos if you are looking for free logo designs just go to canva canva has a free version and a paid version i still use the free version because it serves me. I have everything that I need with it. When I feel like I have gone above the moment where I need more than the free version, of course, I'm going to go for the paid version. But for now, Canva, the free version is serving me very well. And if you are still um, having a lot of troubles with your designs and everything, you can go to Canva. There are so many templates in the platform. You can change the colors, you can make amazing designs and you can even have written reports, um, project reports, annual reports from Canva. Of course, I cannot um, talk about these other applications without talking about Facebook and Instagram. Facebook and Instagram for me have been a platform to showcase the work of our organization. If you go on Facebook and type Girls Excel, I'm going to leave it in the link below in the description section as well as I'm going to link it on the screen of this video so you can see Girls Excel. We use Facebook, um, our Facebook page to showcase the work that we do. We use it for fundraising. In fact, we have had donors approach us on our Facebook page to um, apply for their funding opportunity and we ended up getting the funding. So Facebook is an amazing tool that you can use. It's not just to go out there and talk to people and chat and read gossip. It is also a tool that you can use for advancing and growing your organization or business the same thing with instagram we are only just starting to maximize instagram but we have done a lot on facebook we update our facebook page we share pictures we share project updates and all of that and another thing i'll advise is if you're going to use facebook and instagram try as much as possible to have um a social media strategy that you're going to use for your organization or business before creating an account that will really help you to engage with the kind of um, population a target population or beneficiary or clientele that you are actually looking for please don't forget that all of these applications that i have shared with you are free mobile apps that you can use without having to pay or invest any uh, amount of money on them so guys that was it for um this video about mobile applications that can help you grow your non-profit organization or small business if you did enjoy this video please 
in the comment section don't forget to share with us about the kind of mobile applications that you have also used to grow your non-profit or small business of course until we meet again don't forget to create some impact